I didn't Hi. know you were doing a festival. I thought it was like a one-off small show. Oh, really? Show, yeah. I think it looks like it's a show on the poster. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and I, I was like, oh, okay, that's pretty yeah. cool. Yeah, we didn't know what to expect today. But yeah, it's good. Cool. Awesome, man. How's the tour been? Good. Long. Good Long? Yeah. <coughs> you literally just came off the set it off tour oh, and you've just gone straight into a car. Yeah. Like, it's... Literally. This is the longest we've ever toured. Longest in like a row without going home. Aye, right. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that like, yeah. So we've done like a month before, but we went home between it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right in the middle, yeah. but we all stayed in Berlin between this. Yeah. Uh, so, Janine's partner came over and we yeah. went and hung out at some friends' houses and stuff. Yeah. So, which we all needed. <laughs> yeah, we did. For sure. Ah, uh, so new songs, new lineup. Yeah. New album question mark. Yes. Yeah. Slowly. Yeah. yeah. It seems like it's been a proper labour of love, as in you're still kind yeah. of ironing it all out and. You've been yeah. working on it for a while now. Yeah. Yeah, like I think it's just because of the lineup change and stuff. Like every, there's a lot of stalls. Uh-huh. There's a lot of stalls. 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 A lot of stall installments. A lot of stalls. Um, but we we changed management as well, and like it's got a new, we got a new, signed a new like album deal. Um, with a new label, like yeah. a services deal, and um, just pushed everything back, is it? Yeah, like it has, but like uh, to be honest, I think we want to we want to release singles, but, like we want to do like a single, single, like we don't want to just put too much music out at once. Yeah, yeah, like, we yeah. want to just kind of drip feed it um, to see the kind of re- reaction from it. Um, yeah. So like, yeah, I mean, it's, it's it's the album's pretty much done. We've got like a couple songs left to record. Um, I think we're gonna write a few more at the start of the month. Yeah, or so, next month. yeah. Just, just like we're working with some new people, like um, as well as Bruce, um, yeah. the guys that wrote and produced all the Spice Girls songs. Oh, okay. So like, I'm really interested. I'd be really interested to maybe co-write some with them. So you, you want that kind of alternative pop? Yeah. In an element. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, so they mix, they mix, behave, um, and they mix the next single as well. And I sent it to someone today actually, and they were like, "This sounds like what Spice Girls would be like if they were a rock band, or if they were good." Well, come on, <laughs> maybe don't you dare, de- don't you <laughs> ever? Yeah. Um, yeah. So, yeah, that's that's it. Got to be I'm I'm excited because the vibe on the inside is just everyone. Even though you've been away for a while, there's yeah. still that love and that want for you because it was it's been quite a while it's, since yeah. the mm. Paris tour to absolutely yeah. to set it off tell us about yeah, it <laughs> yeah we know it was been yeah. a fucking scary time because it was like you feel like the time just runs away from you and you're yeah. people have a short attention span as yeah, well so 100%. they're almost like who's it's that, that it's gotten worse since Paris is, is it oh, yeah, and man. people like people don't they don't see what happens back behind the scenes so no. they don't see the shit that's going on and like personal issues and blah blah blah, blah. that's actually a huge part that no one really ever talks about no actually people start to talk about it more now but like the reason this is also taking songs like it's hard as well for us behind the scenes like this is not easy yeah you, know you, can't, I mean? you really can't talk hard. about it as well no be. Like, sometimes I, i've yeah, definitely like, got more vocal on, online being like i'm really struggling or, or like this has been fucking really tough like family you know just, everyone has their own shit going on i mean yeah, yeah. problems families band lineups like fucking questioning life yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we do a lot of that. Yeah, that's what I mean. And it's, it's like, it, it's, we're not the only people that do that. And a majority of people are like that now. But it's like, it just seems to be like no one talks about it. So then it's like, folk are like, oh, they're, yeah, cool, they're a really good band. We like them. Um, they've been away for ages. And actually, really, we should just be more, more like, honest and be like, do you know what, guys? Like, I fucking nearly had a breakdown. Two guys, like, left. Well, do, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. but, yeah. but um, this, it's going to make the record sound better. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. imagine like, what have you been up to? Nothing really. Just yeah. We've just been um, plodding along. Yeah. Um, yeah. Everything's going great. Life yeah. is brilliant. Um, and I'm really happy just now. Could you imagine how shite your album was sound if that was the case? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So um, no, honestly, like I'm the most excited I've been about music ever yeah. for us. Anyway, like I feel oh, like no. we've really, we've really kind of honed in in our writing. Like I feel like me and me and Hamish has like. I don't know. Like, I, I feel a massive difference the past year. I was writing together more exclusively. Like, have you said it's not mature? I don't want to say. Has it matured a lot now? Seeing as it's just like kind of like two of you as the, as the key songwriters instead of it being potentially four. I mean, yeah. I mean, 
Sounds about what do you think? Uh, I think I've only I think it's matured in the way that like we we don't throw songs together anymore. No, like there was no, a time no. where we oh, definitely yeah. would just throw songs together yeah, yeah. and like wing it a wee bit. Yeah. But now like we we demo them pretty yeah. like meticulously. Yes. Do you know what I mean? Like we um, put more thought into them. Yeah. yeah. And actually uh, we know what we want out of our sound. We know what we want it to sound like. Yeah. And like we we've done an like, album, so we know oh, yeah. songs of that album we don't like and why we don't like yeah, them. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And you can take that forward really usefully. 100%. So, especially because ironically, Laddie Die was like one of the last songs written for the first yeah. album. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then, and then we, that became our biggest we song. We wrote that so, song and like honest, it was so quick. Like yeah. that song came together like that. Literally. And like that kind of that formula from that song is something we've really taken yeah, on board. 100%. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, guess you've had I hate long... to use the word formula, but like that's what it becomes. Yeah. A song is a formula. Like, it is. You know you've also had a longer time to write this album as well. Oh yeah, yeah, 100%. So you can just keep it's keep it's going over and over and yeah. over, but you don't want to change it too much otherwise. No, that's it's true. It's funny just, though it, because a majority of the album was written and recorded ages ago. Mm. So mm. like, it's not like we've been not like just writing like one or two. So like, we did do a big, there's a big period of time where we done a massive chunk of the album and a big kind of chunk. Yeah, yeah. And it's been written, and recorded, and obviously when you change lineups and like you've got maybe some other people coming on board. And, and then you start to like you know what I mean our managers suggest like we've never co-written before ever yeah, yeah. so like that's a big thing for us we don't really know but so like that's why we would like to have maybe like maybe one or two tracks that's co-written with these guys yeah, yeah. in the album um, we were we were quite sketchy about it before. yeah 100% like as because oh, we're so protective, so protective of this what we do like because <coughs> yeah, yeah. we've written everything you know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah yeah but um we actually ended up meeting them like yeah. the Spice Girls guys and like they were um so nice yeah they were just they got it they understood what yeah. we were doing and like that's quite rare we find a lot of people oh don't God, really get man. what we're doing yeah. that so. that really you feel quite elated actually yeah, when uh, that happens because I, I literally yeah. talk, I, said, I actually said to him when we talked that I was like I'm going to be honest guys I, I'm I wasn't really like that keep coming the other day yeah. I thought you were going to be like this is shite like, you want to do this this or this like, yeah. follow the zeitgeist instead of following them. like yeah they could <laughs> not I could not have been more wrong yeah. like um, yeah, they were the opposite. Yeah. They were so, like, helpful. Yeah. <laughs> like, but I, yeah. I, I'm just so, ex- I'm honestly so excited about the new music. Like, I feel like, that for my, for mine, I, I just felt like I want to do an album that it's like every song could be a single. Yeah, not, yeah. not just like, oh, that's a filler track. Fuck filler mm-hmm. tracks. Mm-hmm. Every song. Well, I found that with the last album. The last album was just banger after banger. It's and then it was weird. so many, you kind of forget about them. It's, funny, like, it's yeah. funny because I still think there was filler tracks Yeah, on I do too. But well, of course we think that. No, I know, I know. <laughs> but but like, I think especially with the way Mina and Hamish has written this album, we're, at, we're just like, okay, is a single? Yes. Mm. Right, it's good enough then. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's not like, yeah, I mean, it's cool. Like. Yeah, there's, there's actually no no songs that we've written so far that we've been like, it's all right. So it'll be all right like, for We've made sure it's good. Aye. And, and, and most of the songs that were like, it's okay, have been thrown away. Yeah, no, you know 100%. I mean? The only bad thing is now you've got to decide which ones are going to fit into the set list. Yeah. Oh my god, I know. <coughs> for sure. Just throwing that out there. Kind of yes. exci- <laughs> no, but it's exciting for us. <laughs> for sure. Like... It's a good problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, yeah. yeah. I mean, we can't, I mean, we don't want, you could never drop like Anna on Lazy Da. Yeah. For me, I don't think. I'm wired. And Quite wired, I love that. Yeah. Like, boy George. I know. Yeah. Like, but then it's like we're running out of fucking. Because if yeah. we're doing it, it feels sure. like yeah. what we've noticed is Claudia's already caught on <coughs> oh, to be like yeah. a song that folk like associate with like older stuff already. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that song was like yeah. the bridging point between. It was. Last album. Oh yeah, like, exactly. exactly. What it even sounds like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what um, like what you just said there. That was basically like a plugger said this as well. There was she was like, let's do something that's going to cross over well, not just go shock factor. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Um, For sure. But already uh, with the crowd's reactions to Claudia, yeah. um, I'm getting an animal vibe off them. Like, yeah, same. And you can instantly see the, the yeah. their, their body language and yeah. like they're very elated and uh, yeah, it's. It's gonna be. What what has made me realise that it actually takes a while for music to really like connect with people. It doesn't. It's not always. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you, know what you mean? can't just like, put it on repeat and go. Yeah, because behaviour yeah. is still. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. still. Still young as fuck. Still like yeah. catching on to it. Yeah, but Claudia here on Jan- January. In January. Yeah. yeah so it's busy. did it actually? Yeah. I was thinking that. I didn't know if it was February oh, or January. End of, fa- end of Jan- January. No, no, yeah. it wasn't. Because was it's it supposed early? to come out before that tour we did, and it didn't. Oh fuck! It's Remember not the delayed? Early it was my birthday, February seventeenth. Oh what? So we were, po- we were post- oh, one. high five for the seventeenth, February. Oh, you as well? Yeah, 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 yeah. I actually, what the I fuck? That's, we, mu- yeah. we must have had this conversation oh, before. Oh my god, yeah. that's We were post one, and, and Dan P. Carter was playing on it, and I had to be on my phone, oh, that's being like, yeah. uh, new single. I'm fucking watching post one. It was oh, mental. Fuck. Like, oh my god, that's late. Yeah, so we tried to get it out ages ago before our wee headline yeah. tour, yeah, and it just yeah. fell through. It didn't happen, but these things happen. Yeah, man. So. What's the reaction for Behave like? Because that is completely, that's like some weird Japanese pop <laughs> yeah, slash, man. slash punk slash. <coughs> I'm, 
I don't genre know, mashup I don't kind of thing. I don't know how to describe it. I don't. It's pretty mad. Yeah. The, the reception has been the best ever. Like, well, yeah, in, ter- yeah, the in initial terms reception, statistically. Yeah, the initial it's... statistical yeah, was, was the best we've had of a song. Yeah. But I think that was maybe because we were in the middle of quite a big tour as well, and yeah, like, yeah. a lot of folk were seeing it and stuff. Yeah. But but there is a cool video coming out for it soon. Oh, like, yeah, okay. yeah. It's like a. Well, you'll see. Well, that's cool. Oh, we got yeah. Yeah, okay. I don't know. I don't even know if we, it's not. We're, we're not actually in it, but oh, okay. it's, it's really cool. Like. But anyway, yeah, we'll see. Yes. I don't know when it's actually coming out. Um, I don't even know if it's finished. 2020? <laughs> cool. I know when, in our fucking schedule. <laughs> no, it's animation. It'll be a bonus DVD on the... On the <laughs> <laughs> if only we had a DVD, that would be hits. class, man. It's on the greatest hits. Uh, yeah. It's well, funny about the song thing as well, because when we posted, I made like a fake set list. Okay. And got people oh, to like make yeah. up set lists, and the amount of folk asking for like swagger and stuff, I was like, oh, oh my god. We don't play any of the old stuff anymore. Some guy right? was raging at we didn't play it. He's like, I'm a bit miffed that you didn't play it. We miffed, that was the word. Miffed you didn't play it. Um, That's where you just have to call one of the songs the new ones. You just have to like myth. What? just miffed or rebrand the swagger. I was gonna say just write swagger but change it to just make it just cooler. Call it a different name. Because someone was like, "Why do you not play it?" And it was just like it feels like a child song yeah. to me personally. I don't know. I don't know. Like yeah, we, we wrote that a long time ago. Oh my god, it's one of the first songs I've ever. A long time ago. <laughs> so they have to be on the album then. Is the al- have you got the album nailed down or are they what, singles that what? are potentially gonna go on it? We've kind Behave of, or, well, that's the thing, kind we've, of we've pretty much written, that's the thing, we've written. You've got to track list it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Own. Like, we've got a rough idea Sorry. now of what's getting, what, what, what we want, what yeah. order, or we know what our next two singles. We kind of know a rough order. Well, yeah. maybe what our next three singles are going to be, yeah, kind of. Yeah, It's quite, yeah, so we're... Uh, it's just yeah. kind of weird. Yeah. Aye, that's but, far too organised for us, we're not usually that organised. Yeah. But, yeah, we'll see. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a pretty mad album. It's, there's a lot of stuff on it that folk will be like, "What the fuck is this?" Yeah, <laughs> like, like I feel like I, it's, I feel like we've, I just, I've always been conscious of really strong melodies and, and very strong pop structures. Yeah. And then whatever we do in between that, it's fucking, it work, it works. Yeah. yeah. I feel, I think it works. Way, 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 way I think it's sounding just now. Really excited about it. We're playing a new one tonight, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah actually. Kind of yeah. got that's got a bit of an animal vibe to it. Yeah. It's in the same kind of key That's like my favourite like, song. It's yeah. good. It's good. Yeah, it's um, good. I wanted to be a single, and everyone's like, no, and I'm like. <laughs> so have you played any of the other ones live to see if there's a vibe with it? Two. Is it we just... played one that we're playing tonight, and we played another one called Aura, Aura on our headline run. But then we kind of we were going to play it in this, but then we realised that we didn't really have time to rehearse a headline set because yeah. we had the support oh set. Yeah. So we fucking had to throw a set together for Tumbage Wells the first show. Yeah. So we're like, let's make it easy on ourselves. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. So we're not going to play that tonight. But but the set the, that the set is good though. I ah, think we've managed feels, to nail it. It feels really good. Feels good, doesn't it? Like, it really feels good. So uh, it's like the first. I guess it's my favourite set. I agree. Like, yeah, it's totally. Just, it's just it's a good sort of like constant yeah climb yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. apart from uh, we'll call me in a wee but aye, in a good aye. way like yeah, yeah. yeah but energy after that it's just like know, man. <laughs> so is this the staple set list then for the rest of the the this tour kind of yeah and 2000 trees or are you oh, no that'll be that. smaller that'll be, be a smaller. shorter set because that won't but be like, that won't be like a 50 we'll probably have guy. to play yeah. like our next single like that maybe which our drummer needs to learn <laughs> aye so when is 2000 it's like July, July 7th or something I, knew it was, I didn't going? know if it was before or after download and I was like uh is sometimes it's after download I actually don't know it's one of the That's last right. it's one is of it? the last is it? Oh, Bloodstock and Reddit are the last for me oh, nice. Bloodstock oh it's amazing holy fuck I know, <coughs> I know, I know. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, uh, you asked about Martin as well. So Martin jumped on board in like December. Yeah. No, January. Yeah, January. 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 So, uh, you seen them play before, like live? I don't. I'm see not sure. Then, like, I'm not sure. I, yeah, I've seen the videos. Right. I don't think I've seen him live. Live. It's good. It's he's very, very good. ridiculous, man. Like, yeah. it's not even funny. He's very entertaining. What I've noticed about Martin when bringing Martin on board, like when I go out to the crowd and I look back and look back at him as your Martin. He just has this kind of he brings out something in Hamish like like I don't know it's just it's, it, it, it's just man. I it's yeah. honestly it's chemistry like yeah. it's just this it's weird like it's actually entertaining for me to watch like it's, it's, it's good he's one of those people that's like one of the best musicians that we know oh, but he also doesn't take things too seriously no yeah. he's so you know, not he's I, just sort of like fucking here we he go does it take you a while to replace them no no, oh, did it, was no it? but only because um, Colin, our old drummer, who yeah. we're obviously still yeah, 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 one of yeah, our yeah. best friends, you know I mean, like he uh, instantly was like, "This is who you yeah, want to absolutely. take." Yeah, absolutely. But we knew Martin already. Gene yeah. especially knew him. Um, no, one hundred percent. Because Colin, obviously, when he said to us, and I was like, "Absolutely, like, there's no bad vibes at all." But Colin was like, "I think we should have that fucking right." 
that's happening. Yeah. Like, you got Colin, obviously, he felt really bad about it and was like, I don't want to leave you in the shit. Yeah. So, I'm and we actually had a tour coming up as well. So, yeah. uh, he was like, get Martin. He called Martin. Martin that was like, I'm night, in. The same yeah. night. That night, yeah. Literally, Jesus. it was literally within like 24 hours. Yeah. The next night, we went out and get fished for him. Yeah. Went and bring the horizon with him. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Okay. And then and then we got offered that one okay rock tour last minute yeah, yeah, in, yeah. in Europe and like so basically Martin didn't have time couldn't do it so Colin, we had to get Colin re back into the van <laughs> Colin was like I've got a course I'll help you do you know what it I mean? was yeah. fucking so, amazing tour really. which was an unbelievable tour fucking yeah. unbelievable. it was like three shows but it was fucking it mental. was crazy like, man it was like crazy but yeah wild yeah man well I'm excited good. I mean yeah. two singles are completely polar opposites oh really so, yeah. really good yeah that's good no that's good to know. Um, We're so used. To, I'm, I'm so used to hearing them, especially. You just can't, I, mean, I, I just don't, don't know what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> no, what's happening? Like I feel like the next one is totally different as well. Yeah. Yeah. It's a. It's like both of those songs put together, but, but then uh, nothing like them. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's bad. It's fucking weird. But we've kind of kept. We're kind of keeping a. Is it like yeah. a trap song? <laughs> No, it's heavy. It's like quite it heavy. It is heavy, but big pop chorus. But it's got fucking really heavy vocal harmonies, yeah. poppy melody. It's more minor, but then this big uplifting chorus. It's yeah. Cool, it's really, really cool. Well, there's a Spice Girl cover thrown in there. A oh, well, what? Spice Girl cover. You know what I mean? Oh, dude, if only. Oh, man. If only. That would be nice. Fuck. I don't know if I could do that any justice to it. There's a. I can't remember. The, 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 the darkest one they did was that. Spice of Your Life. No. Shouldn't know. Is that the one that's in the future? La, 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 see, a, see a heavy cover of that? It'd be so good, man. fucking amazing. Uh, Zebrahead did a cover of that. I've, I've pretty sure, I am pretty sure I've heard someone do a cover of that. See the Pat and Pendant or Zebrahead? Uh, Pat and Pendant, yeah, I don't know. Uh, fuck, what's the... Oh, the video is like, basically they steal this little girl and they put her in like a toy machine. It's really weird. Is that the covered version of it? No, this is the Spice Girl song. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's Fever Forever. That's the one. That's a tune as well. Yeah. I'm not even gonna try. I'm, gonna I'm try. just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. That would be, that would be amazing. Oh, I love that song. Yeah. I want to know if they wrote that. They must have wrote that. Oh. That's probably one of the best songs ever. Yeah. That's like about it. That's good. Yeah. The fucking melody. Oh that my movie? god. So what's that? So have you got a time frame for this, or are you just kind of just playing it by here and then other people? Pretty much. I think this, I think the singles are kind of lined up now, so. The one every two months. Kind of, yeah. Like okay. we're not gonna. It's just. Well, gonna, yeah. Like the hate was supposed to come out. Yeah. Earlier, for okay. the tour, which makes sense, obviously. But yeah. That fell through, so. Um, yeah. But yeah, I think now, like. I don't know. When, when will the next one come out, Jake? Um. Like trees. I think it's before Jesus. Yeah, it cause, should be before Because obviously, but with new management and a new label, like they're trying to find their feet as well. But now I feel like we, we know the form, where we know like right, so drop behave, and yeah. then let's drop this and this date, and then we've got a timeline now, and it's good to. The only thing I don't think we're even too sure on yet is when to announce the album. Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah that's yeah. the tricky yeah. one. You know what I mean? When and how is it? When and how and yeah, exactly. Yeah, absolutely. Like you kind of want to have a tour pre-booked and. Yeah. Need a lot of forward planning for that, so. Yeah. So is everything kind of like just penciled in? There's not nothing. A hundred percent penciled in right yeah, now. Yeah, like yeah. the album's definitely going to be start of next year. Yeah. Wow. Like nearly positive. I was expecting kind of October, November. Mm, I don't think so. I, I mean, Charles, so thinking, Charles yeah. still same time November. John and Gary were saying. Really. Aye. But look, Charles, see, this thing, yeah, it's just, total just yeah, sketch yeah. right now. It's not. Charles was like November, and then. Aye. A small December. If that can just, happen. Just a small no. December tour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. November, would be, like, November would be ideal for. I'd like that. But yeah, I would rather it come out this year next year because yeah, next year yeah. is a long no, time no. away. Um, I think it kind of has to be. This and year I'd rather we got out the end of this year to set us up for all the festivals next year. Yeah, hundred percent. You know what I mean? Because we're yeah, doing but, a couple of festivals this year. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, yeah, but yeah. I think like the as soon as we can announce the album, the more like pre saves we could get on yeah. our all of our singles and like. Plus the album. Do you know what? See what I've noticed in our at least the industry we're in is like. Albums are actually what make a difference. Yeah. yeah. Singles help like build like yeah, a so, fan base, yeah, but yeah. the album when that drops is really what sells shows. It's so. a yeah. fucking yeah, it's a piece of work. Like it's weird because I, I, you underestimate it. You underestimate the power yeah, yeah. of an album. Hundred percent. That's not, that's one thing I'm saying. The bands that are starting out like don't underestimate an album. No. Don't, Carlo don't, was trying by an album don't at, throw uh, it at a show because you know the artist gets like. Yeah, no, not 100% of them. Like, no, no, you're going to If I go to, HM, if I go to does, HMV yeah. or whatever, I know it's going to go to the HMV people. Yeah, the, no, 100%. It's actually, so we we actually annoyingly couldn't get CDs in time for the start of this tour. We just got them like. Is that where I saw you running out to? Because I, I saw you had like a massive. Batch oh yeah, of I had to sign them. We need to sign them, but, um, but they helped. Like, they lost they helped out so, much so much money because like, of that. Yeah, it sucks. I know. But it's tackle nature of the beast sometimes. Yeah. 